Hello community, let's talk about beauty, music, fashion and lifestyle. Hi everyone! Hello po, mga brad and sis. Good evening. Ayan, good evening na kasi gabi ako nag-record. Ayan, so I would like to say thank you for those people who subscribed to me. So I have additional 50 subscribers within this week. Thank you, thank you so much to all the YouTube creators and my community for helping me and everyone right, who supported me. Thank you so much for friends and family as well. So my um, video will be all about questions. Q&A po tayo ngayon guys. It's gonna be about question and answer portion. And I'm gonna read, actually I plan to have 10 questions but it's just, it's, it came up to 12 questions guys. Wow. So this is from my community. Thank you so much for supporting me and for, um, for, for answering, for, for um, responding to my questions na I need at least 10 questions but you give me 12, right? So more than 10. Alright, so now let's start with my question and answer. Ang pinakauna, number one, is Torito. Ayan, shout out to Torito. Oh, before that, guys, I would like to shout out uh, Cusina Basics. Yes, ayan po, si Cusina Basics. Please uh, subscribe Cusina Basics as well. Marami din po mga masasarap na pagkain kayo makikita doon. You can see a lot of good foods and good stuffs, alright? If you're fond of watching Filipino foods and want to learn a more about cooking Filipino food so you can just go there. Alright, thank you so much, Cusina Basics. Alright, shout out to you. Alright, so let's go for the first question. <laughs> Ito na. The first question by Torita Chavez is How will you conquer fear? How were you able to manage them? Guys, this is English, guys. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so um, how am I able to conquer fear? Guys, fear is inevitable. English tayo, ha? Huh? Um, fear is inevitable because um, everywhere you go, you can experience fear. Maybe in your workplace, in your house, in your um, in, in, in the mall, everywhere, guys, because we don't know what will happen. And, you know, we, we can't predict what will happen tomorrow, tonight, diba? Um, the next day. We cannot prevent it. So, how do I conquer fear? I have a lot of fears, guys. Alright, from things, from subjective or objective, I have a lot of fears. And what do I do is, just, you cannot stop fear you will feel it you have an emotion so what I did was or what I do was I just engage with it you know I just go along with it until I already um, felt or already feel that everything's okay all right very inspirational I am so um, I have a lot of fear for example fear of animals like snakes I have fear of in, I'm not, I don't have fear of cockroach, guys, because when I was young, I usually, you know, battled with cockroach. Maraming cockroach sa bahay namin dati, so pinapatay ko sila. I usually kill them like around more than 10 cockroaches every night. So, I was already exposed to cockroaches nung ano pa lang ako, um, when I was still around 10, alright? So, I don't have any fear of cockroach. So, but I have a fear of snake. Even if in our house before, I've seen a lot of snakes because I'm living near the um, big river. When I was young, we live in a we live this uh, we live in front of a river uh, because we live in like in a subdivision valley. Um, yeah, like a, a, a subdivision that is that has a that has a valley. So I can see a lot of different animals, bats. Um, snakes when we play outside so it's very normal guys and even now i really fear snake because snake they have they have venom right um they're they, they could kill you they're dangerous every animal is dangerous but mostly reptiles are <laughs> really really dangerous guys so 
If I see it, I will really run. <laughs> yeah. So, what? Yeah, I think I already answered Torita's question. How how were I able able to manage them? I just conquer oh! them. I conquer my fear. Um, even in dark places, I have a fear of haunted houses, you know, horror places. But sometimes I love to go there. Like before, when I was young, we have we have some um, we have some areas that uh, in our place, in in my village, in my subdivision, we have some yung, yung mga ano yung mga um, di festival but like a carnival. We have some carnival places and it has like horror house or something so I just go there with my friends, family, cousins and I conquer it. You know, I've seen white ladies even if ano lang siya. I don't have third eye guys. I mean in, in the horror in the horror um, house. Yeah, they, you, you will see many um, vampires, you know, they, they dress like vampires but when I was young, I just conquer it and yeah, that's what well, that's my that's my um, that's my answer. Just conquer your fear. That's how you manage it because you cannot stop it. Just indulge with it. English, adiba. Just um, go with it. Go with the flow. All right, and you will be surprised. You will be able to conquer it. All right. In our daily lives, we have fear, so just go with it, guys. That's how you can manage it. All right. Next number two question. I'll get it from my phone because I screenshot. She screenshotted some of the questions. Most questions. 11 questions, guys. Alright, so next is si Kuya Joey De Vera. Shout out, Kuya Joey. And, uh, so, Kuya Joey has two questions, but I will just read this chronologically, guys, because we have many questions and I just recorded it. Uh, I mean, screenshotted it today. Alright, before I started this QA vlog or QA video. Ayan. Second question. Ay, five sabi. minutes per question. <laughs> Imagine 12 to lahat. Makaabot din tayo ng one hour. So I'll just try my best to answer this um, briefly. Ayan. So, exempted tayo sa first question kasi first pa yun eh. So, next question is gonna be direct to the point. Ayan. So let's go for number two. What would you prefer? Stable but boring works or interesting works with lots of workflow? And English talaga guys, alright? So what would you prefer? Stable but boring works or interesting works with lots of workload? Guys, uh, this is very interesting. The question, the question of Uya Joey is very interesting. I, I'm a person, I'm a risky person guys. I love to take risks. I mean, risky? Mali, risk taker. <laughs> I'm a risk taker person, guys. I love to take risk. When I came here in Thailand, no one invited me. But, you know, to cut the long story short, I was able to get the job that I want. Alright? So, until, yeah, I became a singer. Because, because this is what I want. I just take, took risk. And, actually, when I came here, about I don't have any invitation so it's difficult to go here if you don't have any invitation especially in the immigration part so that's one of the risk uh, re recent uh, risks that I made risk that I made so that was last year and I passed the immigration and I came here yeah so until now I got the job even if my COVID but I can still go back to my job just waiting so it's a, a very risk uh, situation, risky situation for me. So, I would prefer I, I don't like boring jobs, guys. I, you know, I'll try my best to I, I tried my best or I'll always try my best to make my job interesting. Alright? So, I prefer um, interesting work with lots of workload. And so, I, I prefer that. Even if I cannot finish all the workloads, but I still finished right some parts it's still um it's still a good um way for me you know it's still a su success for me so i prefer to like for example um i want to become a singer so it's be it became a risky part for me to go abroad to become a singer because no one invited me i just came here as a tourist and then i auditioned and then i got the job so it's very risky Ayan, so 
Like for example, I have projects because I'm also a streamer, so I, I sing online. I have many projects, so it's it's a lot of workloads, guys. This is what I do now. Um, but you know, it's it's very interesting. Yes, and and it's we, we just only live once. But make sure na you know we still take we still take care of ourselves, especially our health. All right. So, but I prefer interesting job with with lots of workload. This is what um, Kuya Joey means. All right. So that's it. Next, number three. <laughs> Ayan, natatawa ako kasi ano na to eh. Cheesy, cheesy question ni Kuya Joey. What was the best moment in your relationship so far? So are you smiling while recalling that moment? Ayan, di ba? Wow, si Kuya Joey talaga nagpunta ng worry. So this, this is very interesting for me guys as well. Salamat, salamat, salamat. So, um, the best moment, every day is the best moment for me. So, you know, um, every re whatever relationship is that, family or, you know, your loved one. So, it's every day, every day counts because we only live once, is what I said. Um, whether you fight or whether you um, conquer something, you know, um, for me, it's the best moment moment that I could treasure you know as long as I was as long as I am with them yes so um, maybe this relationship kuya is yung karelasyon mo talaga like your your loved one you know like your partner or your um, your your, your uh, lover like that so the best moment as well is I was able to um, manage everything attitudes because we have different attitudes um, and you know it's it's very it, it's very challenging especially if your uh, partner or if your uh, you know your lover is also not the same um, culture as you like that if it's a foreigner or kahit Pinoy diba? so we have different attitudes you need to you need to understand your partner. So, yun lang. Um, best moment for me was we were able to understand each other even we have differences. Yun talaga pinaka-importante guys. You need to understand your partner's attitude and he also needs or she also needs to understand you so that you could make your relationship last longer. Ayan, di ba? Tips. Ayan, mga love tips by Ate Kim. So, let's go for another question. By Bebe Miles. Ayan. Che Cherry Coderes. Ayan. Kay Mai Shai. So, what was the best thing to do when you love the... <laughs> oh, guys. Love story pa din. Ayan. What was the best thing to do when you love the person? But he's never in love with you. Ay, <laughs> grabe ito, guys. <laughs> grabe ito, guys. Ayan. Hindi ko pa naman na-try ito, guys. Yung... Kasi I make sure naman, in my case, I'll make sure na yung talagang crush ko or something, yung may pag-asa din ako siyang magka-crush sa akin. <laughs> Unless yung artista talaga yung crush mo. It's really difficult for him to, or for her to love, to, to, to like you back. Kasi it's a celebrity, right? So it's it's just um, an imaginary, imaginary crush. But this one is like, like a normal person, you know, and is not in love with you or she's not in love with you and even if you're in love with her or him it really hurts you know? the best thing to do number one is even if you were, weren't in a relationship together just move on from your feelings it's not easy but you know one day you'll, you'll be you are going to accept it you know you, you'll have acceptance because you'll be able to understand the reality Ayan, yung totoo, you know, yung, the reality, Re reality hurts, but, you know, it's very helpful. It could make you grow, ayan, so, just don't mind that, and next, you know, parang a next opportunity lang, if one, door clo if one door closes, another one opens, ayan, so, <laughs> diba, ayan, diba, Bebe Miles, paano mo malalaman kung special ka sa taong gusto mo? <laughs> vlog ba to? Oh, a love confession. Love confession na to, bebe. Ayan. Paano mo malalaman kung special ka sa taong 
gusto mo. Pag special ka talaga, guys, he will he or she will make time for you. Alright? If, if the person likes you, if nasa ligawan stage pa lang kayo, if, if you're still in the courting stage, I try to uh, translate it in English, guys, so it's not difficult for me to edit because I don't like to edit subtitles as much as possible. So just bear with me. I need to speak in English. So, um, if, if you're special to the person, the person, as what I've said, it, she, he or she will make time for you. Um, you don't need to question it because time is very valuable for a person. He or she will not make time for you, give time for you, even if long distance through call or just go in your, to your house or invite you to invite you, invite you out like that. It's still a time. It's still time. So the person will really make time for you, even if it's just phone calls because it's maybe it's difficult. You know, they're still uh, COVID now. They cannot go to your house. They cannot go to them. So they cannot invite you outside. So just phone call or chat or phone call. Much better phone call, guys, because you really you will really hear their voice. The person will really make time for you if you're special to that person. Yes. Okay. Or just reply to you like that. If hindi, guys, move on na. Next na naman. Huwag nang magtagal. Masasaktan ka lang. It will really hurt you. So, just go to the next one. <laughs> Alright. To the next future chuchu. Ano ba yan? So, next is by Torito. What is the best thing that happened in your life? Ah, so, recently, the best thing that happened in my life was I got my dream job abroad. So here in Thailand, guys, I'm, I'm currently living now. And I just took risk. Uh, I came from the Philippines and I came here as a tourist. And then when uh, after a month, I got a job. So imagine, guys, that was a big leap for me and that was a very successful situation for me. That I haven't... No one invited me to work for it. To, to, to work here but I just made it myself yes so that's it just take the leap take uh, have faith you know trust yourself next if you given a chance to bring back the memory memorable happening happened the memorable happening to be honest in your life what is it can you share it to us if you given a chance to bring back the memorable happening in your life what is it can you share it to us of course guys my mom died since i was three so if i could turn back the time you know i wish my mother was still alive but my mother needs to sacrifice and sacrifice oh, sacrifice no. her life just for my brother to live because my brother my mom um had a cancer and it's already stage three or end stage so the only thing it could lead to stage three, and so the only thing that she she needs to do, or she has two choices: to kill the child, which is my brother, younger brother inside, to kill the the, 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 the child inside, because she was already pregnant when she knew that her cancer worsens, um, or she will continue. Uh, she she will choose my brother and sacrifice her life. You know. Um, Yung mga cells niya, lahat, cancer cells, everything. So, because the, the child will get all her nutrients and everything. Healthy cells. And she chose to, yeah, she's a hero. She chose to, 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 to die and continue the therapy and to, to save my brother. So, if I could turn back the time, I would like my mother to live. But everything will change. History, everything will change. So, hindi ko alam if we, we already know each other now, you know, if we could turn back the time. But yeah, that's my wish, of course. My mom. Next, <laughs> yung kay Belle, natatawa ko guys, ayan. Paano mo ma-achieve ang kilay goals mo? Hindi <laughs> 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 naman maganda yung kilay ko guys. Sinusunod ko lang yung forma niya. I just try to to draw according to its... Actually, I don't, I didn't uh, pluck my eyebrows. Recently, because yun nga, um, I didn't pluck it because I want, I I just want it to get to to be thicker, you know, like that. So I didn't go to salon or anything. 
and saka I'm afraid to go to salon right now. Even if in Thailand it's been a month, we don't have COVID, but yeah, I just don't trust for now. <laughs> just anything na ano, I'm not sure of. So, pina follow ko lang. I just follow the I, I, my my brow line. So that's it. And good thing my brow line, my my, my brows are good. The shape is good, you know, I don't need to have, a, but the problem, my only problem is my brows are not that thick. So I need to really have a brow pencil. So brow, brow pencil works good for me. I'm not really into tattoos, you know, um, as much as possible, I would like it to become natural. I would like it, I, I would like it to be natural. Ayan guys, so punta na tayo sa next question, masyado nang mahaba. So paano magpabilis lang? <laughs> This is pinaka talagang pinaka important question dito guys. This is the most important question so far. Nako, paano magpabilis ng lag? <laughs> of course, palitan mo na 'yan, oh, no. 'di ba? So laban lang ter, laban lang laban lang bebe. All right? So uh, you need to change your internet connection if it's really slow. Ayan. Next, by Mertz Pakada. Ayan, marami nagsasabi ang buhay maikli lang. Pero kung ikaw bibigyan ng isang pagkakataon, ano ito? Sino o kanino ito? <laughs> diba? Yeah. I love this question. You only live once. If you, um, if you're given the chance um, to, to change your life, what would it be or who would it be? And why? Wow. Pang Miss Universe there. Ayan. So, um, eto na. If I'm going, this is very impromptu, guys. I really don't have any copy, so baka later magsisi ako, <laughs> you know. Um, isip ko, eh, mali pala, dapat ganito pala. I must answer this question, but I, I must answer this for that question. But anyway, it's just for fun, guys. Um, if I'll be given the chance, of course, um, I would. I would love to become a Miss Universe or princess. <laughs> di ba? Mag, mag ano ka na lang, mag wish ka na lang, di ba? Yun ang todo-todo na, ayan. I would love to become a princess so that I'll be living in a, you know, silver spoon, ganyan. And then, Miss Universe, of course, I would become, I would like to become taller, like that. And yeah, if, if I'll be given the chance, I, I, I want to feel how it feels to be in that position, to be in that situation. I know it's gonna be heavy, but if I will be given the chance, why not? Right? Ayan. So, thank you for that question. Or I would like, I'd like to become a bird. <laughs> Free to fly. Charot. <laughs> Pang bata. Ayan. So, let's go for another one. Ito na. Um, last two questions na, guys. Tama? Yeah, last two questions na naku. Um, in our life, there's a lot of struggle. Give one of them, and how can you face it? Ayan, by tulito, bongo. Ayan, there's a lot of struggle. Give one of them, and how can you face it? So, some of the struggles that I faced is. like to talk about um, like depression guys because every one of us uh, have depression oh. Ayan. so even if I'm a very happy person even if I am a very jolly person I, I could also be depressed all right I like to talk about negative but it's very important all of us experience depression especially especially in this situation na meron pang wala pang trabaho um, COVID, my COVID situation pa, all right, still waiting for everything to to go back uh, to normal. Ayan. So, every one of us experience depression in different ways. It might, it might be big for you or small for me or, you know, because I sometimes I experience it, but good thing I was able to manage it. And there are people uh, beside me. And I also have uh, online jobs. I could also divert my emotion yes but, but but other people cannot handle it properly um, recently there is an OFW or a Filipino teacher here in Bangkok in Thailand who who commit committed suicide oh. because he cannot handle things anymore no job like that so I just would like to I forgot the name but you don't need to know it right? because it's 
so sad for for the family. Ayan. And struggle is you'll really be sad. Especially if you're alone. Alright? So you will really need you really need to conquer it. You know, it's part of struggle. You became sad and you became everything becomes blank all right you don't know what to do you don't know how to say it to your family especially if you have a problem like that so depression is normal to us it have a it has a lot of faces so you need to conquer it you need to step up and learn how to fight you know even if you don't have a job learn to do things that could make you productive clean the house or read books Good books or even online ebooks. Read if you have, don't have internet, maybe you could borrow books or just go to the nature. Ayan, pwede naman, you know, you can just go to the near mountain or just go to your family and friends. You know, you need to conquer it, guys, and face face it because in that way, if you face it, if you don't deny it, you'll be able to conquer it. Ayan. So, yun talaga guys. Parang yung fear lang. Ayan. And last question. Ayan. Wow po talaga tayo ng 30 minutes. 30 minutes na talaga to. By Carl Ezael. <laughs> Ang ganda ng last question guys. Who is your first crush? <laughs> okay. Who is my first crush? It's an artist. My first crush before was... Um, if I could still remember, he didn't tell... If it's a celebrity or not, but for me, it's a celebrity. My first celebrity crush, a celebrity si Ate, um, is Nick Carter. No, no, Aaron Carter. Aaron Carter was my first crush. Ayan yung kapatid ni Nick Carter ng Backstreet Boys. Kasi um, Nick Carter is really very handsome. I don't know how's Nick Carter na yung komanta ng I'm all about you. I'm all about us. Baby, you never have to question my love. So, before, mayroon akong poster sa buong kwarto ko ng Nick Carter pictures. Kasi ang guwapo niya talaga. He's so handsome. And, yeah, he's my first crush. Celebrity crush. Yeah, I couldn't recall because when I was young, I was a boyish. Oh, no. I was boyish and I don't have many crushes. But someone had crush on me but I don't really had a crush. And, yeah, I do have but maybe on high school now. Uh, in, 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 School. I got the crush. So, ayan. Ah, meron pala. Yung child, ah, uh, no, yung kapit, uh, our neighbor. But, but, he was not my first crush. My first crush was a celebrity when I was, uh, 11 or 10. Like that. Or 11. Because 12. Yeah, that was the first, uh, crush. The neighbor. My neighbor. Ayan. So, <laughs> thank you so much, guys. I don't like to stay longer. Maybe 30 minutes is enough. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Thank you to my team. Shout out. Thank you so much to my team for for uh, helping me and for supporting me. And if you want to be part of my team, guys, you can just go to the link below and go there directly. Just join and I'm the, I'm the only admin there. So I can accept you. Alright, so thank you so much and watch for my next vlogs. And don't forget to click subscribe if you're if it's your first time to watch this. Alright, thank you so much guys. And you do have a good day. And salamat po. Goodbye. See you again.